24 hours stop work at midnight last night and they claim up to 75% of the drivers walked off the job. Across the city, bus drivers set up picket lines at depots determined to stop non-union members getting onto the road. The rebel drivers turned back each time, entire bus fleets locked up and left deserted. I think the average driver um, it was willing to work and, and doesn't really want to disrupt the public, certainly like what's happened today. Up to 750,000 commuters were left waiting for buses that never came. Many angry they couldn't get to work. By the time we get there we'll be pretty late for work, um, so we're not going to be in the good books with the boss, but as I say, it's not our fault. School children were the worst affected, half a million left without transport in Newcastle, across Sydney's west and in Wollongong. We can't get home this afternoon because there's no buses. We haven't organised anyone to pick us up. Most were forced to walk, parents furious their children had to cross roads and angry they were given little warning. It's unfair because if you're a working parent, you can't go like that and get them to school. The strike is over a pay claim by drivers. Bus operators are offering $77 a week over three years. But drivers want double that. We carry people, which are precious cargo. It's not newspapers, it's not, you know, frozen goods. The union is also demanding better safety for drivers. I've been assaulted with a screwdriver. I've been had broken ribs and uh, my face all punched in. Bus operators say the rise would make ticket prices unaffordable. I think they are greedy compared to the community, but I do believe that they deserve a, a, a reasonable rise and that's what we offered them. Yeah, well, the unions and the bus drivers met in the uh, Industrial Relations Commission this afternoon. They were told that the strike was futile and they had to come back again tomorrow and discuss a new pay deal. Now, the bus drivers will go back at work to midnight tonight. That won't help people trying to get home now, but it will mean all the services will be back online tomorrow morning. <laughs>